Hello, today we're going to look at FLIP, the Financial Learning and Investment Platform Strategy Wizard. So what I'd like to do today is demonstrate for you how to build a portfolio. So in your upper left hand corner here, you can see my portfolio. You can see that right now we're 100% in cash. So I'm going to show you how to add a couple of symbols and uh, pair them up with some strategies. So let's go ahead and enter a couple stocks. We'll go ahead and start with Hall Halliburton which is one that um, I personally like. You look over to the right here, we get some basic information on Halliburton, some price data, so we can see the 52-week range, we can see the volume, and uh, we can see some PE, earnings per share, dividend yield, some basic information so we don't need to go anywhere else. Then we scroll down, and the beauty of our software is we provide you with a library of time-tested proven strategies with efficacy, and they show you how they performed over time. So if we look at this, Halliburton, it appears that the basic stop strategy um, is up about 384%, which is about a 29% return annualized. Let's go ahead and click on that and take a look and see if this is something that we'd like to add to our portfolio. So over to the right here, you can see that we have this little box here. This is a gauge uh, demonstrating how this one performed over time. And we can see all of these started back January 1st of 2004. We run, we run it back 12 years because we want to know that over the last 12 years, whether or not the software has or the uh, strategy has performed well or not. So you can see the equity curve over some time here. Then if we want to go ahead and zoom in and take a deeper look at that particular strategy, then what we have here is our details page. So up top, it shows us what our total P&L is. So the assumption in our software is that you started with $10,000 January 1st of 2004, and this is how that $10,000 would have grown over time. So you can see the P&L here, it made $38,469, which is a 384% return. Month to date, you can see it's down $2,000. Year to date, it's down $1,800. Last 12 months is down $1,800 last two years is down 2018 and the last five years it's up 12,771 so let's go ahead and look at a couple things down below so this is the money curve how the money grew over time and please take note that you don't really see any significant drawdowns during this period of time yes there was a little drawdown here there was a little drawdown here another little drawdown here However, you don't see any of those catastrophic drawdowns, um, especially that you can see when you own oil-related positions um, and they uh, you know, fall off a cliff every few years. So if we look here in the middle section, give you some information, here's your total P&L, your ROI, your profit factor, commission per side, number of trades. So this particular system only did 35 trades over the last 12 years. Some of our strategies um, are similar to that. Other ones, you know, maybe do a couple of trades a month. So then we've got our open profit. So we have a position right now that it is down eighteen hundred dollars. Um, the best day, twenty two eighty eight. The winning trade average is four thousand two hundred and thirty three. Now, if we look right next to that, we see losing trade average. The losing trade average is about two thousand six hundred and eleven. So when we win, we win more than we lose. Always a good thing. <clears throat> then we go through, we see the Sharp ratio, the Sorrentino ratio down below. And let's go ahead and scroll down. Then we have a breakdown down below going back to January 1st, 2004. <clears throat> and this demonstrates how the money grew over time and gives you a month-by-month month month synopsis of how this strategy performed trading Halliburton. So you get a lot of information, and the beauty of the system is you can make very sophisticated decisions very easily by clicking buttons. So let's say that we like this strategy and we want to go, go ahead and add it. We simply just click Add, and then what's going to happen is it's going to deposit that over here in my portfolio. So let's go ahead and just add one more um, <clears throat> let's go ahead and add 
a biotech company. Let's go ahead and add Gilead, for example. So we click on Gilead. We've got our price information right here. And then down below, here's our strategies. So this one did about an 86% return. We know that this particular biotech stock has been on fire. Um, we go ahead and click details. We can see on this particular one, the equity curve is building right now. This is the equity curve over time. So your $10,000 turned into $112,000. So we look at the statistics. And if this looks like one that you want to add to your um, portfolio, you got 242 trades on this particular one. <clears throat> so it looks like this one's performing very well. We go ahead and click Add. And it's added to our portfolio. And there it is. So now, let's say that we want to adjust our portfolio and change the percentage. This is all you do is you click on the little pencil here, and you can go ahead and change this. So let's say that we want 20% on Halliburton, 10% on Gilead, and we've got 70% in cash. So it's very simple. Uh, that's how you build a portfolio. You can add as many system symbol pairs as you would like to build your portfolio. Once you are completed with that, you go ahead and click Save, and then the system's ready to go. Those positions will move over to your watch list on the Automated Trader, and it'll begin uh, sending you signals whether to buy or whether to sell, and it will handle the rest. Thank you so much.